Hi guys, welcome to Simply Scuba. Now when some ships are artificially sunk, others have a more tragic ending. Here are five of the most haunted shipwrecks. You can actually explore each of these which have a tragic story to tell. First up, we have the SS Andrea Doria. This 697 foot long passenger liner made its maiden voyage in 1953. However, only three years later, tragedy struck. Clouded in thick fog, she collided with another passenger liner, and half of Doria's lifeboats were destroyed. The ship took 11 hours to sink, and 1,660 passengers were saved, but sadly 46 people were killed, and divers have reported seeing strange things in the corner of their vision during a dive. The ship now lies quite deep down at 73 metres too. And now we have the SS Thistlegorm. Thistlegorm is widely regarded as one of the best wreck dives in the world. In 1941, this armed merchant ship was sunk by German bombers in the Red Sea. Nine crewmen lost their lives in the attack, and now this is a graveyard of military history. You can see motorcycles, trucks and cars, and divers always seem to come back to this site and find something new. Next up, we have the HMS Rhone. This UK Royal Mail ship was struck by a hurricane near the British Virgin Islands and was sunk in 1867 and it's believed that 124 people lost their lives. Many divers have claimed to see strange things whilst exploring this wreck. These include hearing screams underwater and even being touched. What makes this story even worse is that some of the passengers were tied to their bunks to save them from injury. The ship now rests at a depth of 24 meters. Now we have the Salem Express in the Red Sea. The Salem Express is renowned for its tragic ending. In 1991, this passenger ship collided with the Heinemann Reef, which caused the bow to blow open. It's believed that 470 people had lost their lives. Although many of the bodies were recovered, a lot of them were left inside the wreck in their watery grave. Inside the bows of the ship, you can find items frozen in time. Cars, TVs, and most tragically, children's toys and clothing. The ship now rests in just 30 metres of water, with its highest point at 12 metres. Finally, we have Chuck Lagoon. This is the world's largest underwater military graveyard. Hidden beneath the waves of the Central Pacific lie the resting places of thousands of people. 60 ships, 275 aircraft and even human remains litter the ocean floor. In 1944, Allied forces launched an attack on this Japanese base. This was called Operation Hailstorm, where nearly 3,000 people lost their lives. Ships such as the Shinkoku Maru are now alive with bright corals and fish. Have any of you guys dived these wrecks and do you think they're haunted? Let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching and safe diving. If you like this video, click on that subscribe button to see more like it. Check out our other videos over here. And if you like the haunted dive sites, check out the creepiest places to dive here.